Hello everybody, it's me Monster Matt 345 here and today's video review is very very exciting because I am reviewing technically it's an old monster drink it's actually a very very old monster drink but it's got at least a new can design and possibly a retooled flavor which I kind of hope not to be honest with you it is the new monster energy assault now as you can see it has a very army themed can design here it is camouflage based it's very very pretty very unique and it has that big red M on it. Now, long-term drinkers of Monster will recognize Monster Salt. It was, I'm not too sure when it was created, but it was one of the very first Monster drinks whenever, you know, it had been out for a long time whenever I started drinking it. And most people would recognize it from the can design where it was just a normal black monster can but instead of the instead of the green m for monster it was a the, the same red m here and it was always a monster that i found kind of weird i remember whenever i was younger going to witherspoons and i was kind of on a bit of a monster kick at the time and there was a drink there that i had never tried before called monster salt so i i think to be honest with you it was at that stage where monster was kind of discontinuing the flavor they were winding down the amount of it they were selling and they sold off a lot of cans to witherspoons because i had never seen it before on the shelves anywhere and whenever i seen it i just couldn't resist getting it but very oddly it was very very disappointing to be honest with you monster assault it's basically a cola energy drink it's kind of reminds me of cherry cola there's flavors of cherry there's there's that authentic cola taste which there's nothing in the world that tastes like cola so it's hard to kind of describe how cola tastes but anybody who's tried coke or pepsi before will be fully aware of how it tastes so it was something that i that i tried and the flavor just repulsed me it was something that i could not stomach at all you know it, it didn't work with my taste palette and for some reason it just did not work for me and then a fair few years ago now i think it was in 2018 or 2019 i went to germany with my then partner and again they had monster assault for sale and again i tried it and did not like it so i was two for two at the time but for some reason a couple of years on i seen monster assault being sold in pound stretcher which is a british chain over here in the uk that sells discounted things, usually things from different countries, um, and imported things that are that they bring in cheap so they can sell cheap. And I seen Assault, and I think it was in a little 250 milliliter can. I did do a review for this a long time ago. Man, I've been on YouTube for a long time, and you know, obviously, time just flies whenever you're having fun, and unfortunately, whenever you're in your 20s. So, I took a chance on this 250ml monster and I ended up absolutely loving it. And you'll see that's why I have the I'll have the review on the channel. I started buying a lot of the 250ml assault. I'm really, really enjoying it. But again, you know, pound stretcher, because they're selling things on a discount, that line stopped. They did bring in another energy drink. I can't remember the name for the life of me, but it was it was in a different language. And it was called Fury, I think. And again, it was essentially Monster Salt. And again, I liked it. So I've never really had the proper official intended for the UK or the US release Monster Assault. So I'm very, very excited to try this flavor. I know that Monster basically, like I said, it was very early on in the days whenever they started making this monster. And it had the completely black design and just just the you know the the big m in the middle but i think over time they started developing more and more new flavors and eventually it got to the stage where if you only did the black and red can design you would run out of colors in the color palette so bringing back monster bringing it in this lovely bringing back monster salt sorry and bringing it in this lovely camouflage design was pretty cool so whenever i seen it the other day for the first time in the uk i was like you know what i'm gonna snap this up i'm gonna try it if it's anything like the monsters of the past it'll be getting a five out of five and everything will be all good and i'm saying that with a lot of trepidation because obviously i tried the you know the very recently i did the whole lucasaid review the lucasaid alert original flavor review and i was so excited for it and then ended up being very 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 let's keep going with the various very 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 disappointed with it 
So hopefully today there will not be disappointment. Like I say, I think this is for sale just in the UK right now in select stores because I've looked a long time for this and the can design has been online and on Reddit for a while and I haven't actually seen it anywhere. So we'll, 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 we'll give it a try here if I can stop stammering. And one interesting thing about this Monster Salt is it used to annoy me whenever I bought it from Pound Stretchers. It had no kind of, you know, little description in the back like all the monsters have. And I think, or it did have one, sorry, but it was in a different language, so I didn't understand it. And I always felt kind of sad about it because I wanted to hear what the description was for Monster Assault. So lo and behold, I got this and I was excited to finally find out the description. And look, no description. There is just a... A little thing here promoting um promoting a uh, uh, some in-game content for a game called apex legends and i don't know if that replaced the replaced the description or what the whole crack was there but i was very disappointed because i want to know what monster assault what the description is i want to know what they're trying to do with it i want to know is it supposed to be like cola is it supposed to be cherry cola is it supposed to be just its own drink and assault in the senses. I have no idea, but I'm gonna open this up here and we will we will hopefully get a good result. Um good results have not been my thing recently on this on this channel by 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 the most, but let's give it a try. So the first thing I get here is essentially the smell of Coca-Cola, which is again hard to describe. But it, it it's the smell of Coca-Cola and there's a tinge of cherry in there as well that hits you after. But it is such a heavenly smell. I can't wait to try this. Oh man, oh man, this smells good. Okay, so it smells of Coke. Not of, not of the white powder, but just of cocaine. No, <laughs> not, not of the white powder, just of Coca-Cola. And... I, with, with a bit of cherry and, and I was always a big fan of cherry coke growing up so I am pumped for this right now to be honest with you to tell you the truth I'm just gonna start drinking it to be honest because one I'm thirsty and two that's the point of this review <laughs> wow that that makes me smile. <laughs> that makes me have a big grin on my face because wow. It is just like drinking Coke, which is very strange. It genuinely it tastes now obviously there is that cherry that comes in there and hits you and kind of just smooths over your tongue, but all in all, it tastes as if Coca-Cola made an energy drink, which they did, I just realised. And ironically, it tastes better than the Coca-Cola energy drink, which is now, by the way, impossible to buy in the UK because Coca-Cola bungled it so bad that it was not a popular drink at all. I think I remember, like, seeing it in one of the discounty places, you know, a Pound Stretchers or... No, it wasn't Pound Stretchers. It was, it was B&M or Home Bargains or Poundland, one of those ones, for 19 pence. So the Coca-Cola energy drink really did not hit it off. But wow, Monster Assault is as good as I remember the times I liked it. And obviously significantly better from back in the day. And it's just so interesting because I would bet money that aside from some slight changes, this flavour hasn't changed at all from the first time that I tried it. But that was, that was at least seven years ago. And they say that, you know, your taste palette, your body, it changes over over time over around seven years and things that didn't taste nice to you at the time taste really nice now and I guess that's what's happened here because this is a beautiful beautiful drink wow I'm sorry <laughs> so this drink actually it has that, you know the way whenever you drink Coca-Cola, you have that really sticky taste in your mouth. I can't think of a better way to describe it except for sticky. But it, it, it just, the taste kind of lingers in your mouth. You can kind of feel yourself going, 
like like that there. It's it's such a unique, interesting taste. And Monster Assault provides the same thing with, like I say, a hint of cherry that just adds that. To be honest with you, cherry on top of the on top of the can. <laughs> It is so enjoyable and smooth and I can't say enough positive things about Monster Salt, which is fair. It's, it makes me very happy because it's such a strong, great energy drink. And I encourage anybody who likes cola, who likes cherry drinks, who likes Monster, obviously, who enjoys the sugary Monsters because I can feel that sugar rush hitting me as I talk, to go out of their way to try this because this is very special and delicious and please don't take it away from us monster because you went through all that effort of bringing out the new can designs and i can see a little bit on the, the rim of the can here and it's it looks like coca-cola as well so monster energy assault i am giving a resounding positive 100 percent confidence based five out of five because it is so good and delicious and sweet and ooh, it is a very very good drink and now I'm kind of annoyed because I seen this in a shop in Belfast which is it's about 40 minutes away from where I live and I'm not going to be going up there anytime soon so I will not be getting that sweet sweet monster salt for quite some time and that makes me very sad but yeah five out of five for monster salt it is fantastic it's a very, very solid drink, and I don't find myself saying that enough on this channel for the energy drinks I review. So that's a very positive. I'm very happy. That's a great way to start my day. I hope that all your days go well. I hope that, you know, it's you smile like I've smiled after drinking this Monster Energy of Salt, and that you're all taking care of yourselves and staying safe, and that, that everything's good with you, you know, because... Life can be hard sometimes, as I, I talk about a lot on this channel, and sometimes the best thing to do is just try and stay positive and try and stay happy. And this energy drink makes me happy. So thank you guys for checking out this video. Thank you for your views. And let me know if you've ever tried this drink before in the comments section. And I hope that you all thoroughly enjoy it because I certainly am. Thank you very much. This has been Monster Matt 345 and I'll catch you all again after a while. Bye everybody. Take take care, okay? Thank you for thank you for watching.